Well, good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. This is the lineup we've been given. How do you read it, Jim? Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running, and it enables risk taking while the gaps are filled. I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works, it's still valid and I think we're going to see it be successful here. So it's down to business here. So Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Jorginho, the kind of player that can pass a team to death. At first, a lot of his passes seem a little safe and conservative, but they all serve a, a bigger purpose, slowly shifting the opposition from side to side. Once there is that little bit of space to work in, then the killer instinct usually kicks in and he's able to deliver that decisive pass. Has a hit! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Wonderful goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Chelsea have an early lead. Good start. Bruno tries to stroke it through. Harvards. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Chelsea have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Hoist it forward. Lucas Paqueta. Lucas Paqueta hits that long. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he... Shapes to shoot! Back of the net! Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their leveller. Oh, 
high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, what a convincing response to going behind. They've got all the momentum now. Rudiger. Conte. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Harvards. And it's James. James is fouled. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Over to the left. Away from immediate danger. Conte. James. Forward it goes. Gets wrestled off the ball. Conte. Kante switches it towards the other side. Thiago Silva. Rudiger. Rudiger gets it forward. Played back in. Goes for goal! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Cleared away. Cornier gets rid without sophistication. Rudiger. The uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. In for a hefty challenge. <laughs> and the whistler's gone for a reckless challenge there. James is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Their attempt, just the wrong outcome. Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. And it's half-time here. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. We can review the first half. Look, this match promised goals and it certainly hasn't let us down. It's been really, really entertaining. Lyon head into the dressing room after a half in which we've seen two goals, one each. And the game right on edge. And the game has already resumed here. 
Chelsea getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Going for goal! James turns and goes back. Jorginho. Jorginho has created one goal already. Mant. Look, and the shot! Jorginho. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Defenders on the back foot. And it's played forward. Werner. Uh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. <laughs> Crunching tackle. Nicely measured pass. Gets away from... Real chance! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Jorginho. Chilwell. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Cornier. Conte. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal. And he didn't go for the back heel. How about a shot? And a second time! Big chance! Goal! Chelsea! And they get themselves in front! Werner with a predatory goal. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk. As cunning as it comes. Ah, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Chelsea get themselves into the lead. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Lucas Paqueta. Chilwell tries to get it forward quickly. Werner. Werner proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Oh, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Conte. Rudiger. Across the field it goes. Mant. Lyon are in a tearing hurry to save themselves here. Look, their path is set. They have to take risks in every situation now. That's the throw. Rudiger. Talk about singling someone out. Look, if they want to shut down the threat, he's a very good place to start. Cornier. Denier. Well, they're supposed to be chasing a goal, and yet there's no urgency or sense of awareness. They've got to wake up. Lucas Paqueta. He's gone a long way up and away. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Gets it into the middle. Rudiger tries to clear. 
Look at the defender bombing forward. Gets up to head it! And that has been clubbed away. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Lyon probably deserved a share of this, but of course you don't always get what you deserve, and they're going to have to swallow a defeat.